So normally, uh, when I play the harp, I, um, I accompany myself kind of like a guitar or a, like a piano. And so I, I set a little groove. Uh, But a lot of you Arcade Fire fans will recognize this heart part um, off of their first album called Funeral. It's called Backseat. Okay, so what Arcade Fire used the harp for was uh, just to do some frosting on the cake and to add a, a color, a harpistic color, to a couple of their rock songs. And this is from the album Neon Bible. The tune is Black Mirror. And um, they used a symphony out of Prague, and they, the, the tag at the end of the piece started really high with violins and then it went to cellos and then it went lower to horns and the brass section and then down to the bass and then down to the kettle drums at the very end. So Regine wanted me to copy that orchestral thing on the harp and all the stuff I do with Arcade Fire I improvise which is lucky for them that I can do that. <laughs> but um, <clears throat> so Black Mirror kind of went like this. It started high play the tune and, and you can hear how that sounds with the with with the CD. Okay, this is the end of Arcade Fire's song, The Well in the Lighthouse, on the Neon Bible album. And um, they wanted me to play a sound that sounded like the moon shining back from the bottom of the well. So it's just a little... A little passage like that, and I'll play it with the music. <laughs> 